It is a beautiful day in Las Vegas. It's not too windy, not too cold. We are at the Goodwill bins and we're ready to go. We're gonna go find some stuff, most of which we're gonna put in our whatnot auction, some of which we're gonna put on eBay. I'm ready to go. It's been a few days since we've been here, right, Don? Oh yeah. You know, when you don't go here for a few days, you start to, to wanna go back. I'd say we did pretty good, right, Don? Oh my gosh. We doubled up, doubled up two carts. Today was a hectic day, boy. Oh, it was stressful. It's Glenn. President's Day. Um, there's a lot of people here today, guys. It was violent. <laughs> it was intense. It was intense, guys. We're gonna go through all these finds, let you know what we find or found. What's the past tense? Found? Founded? Here is what we spent on both of these carts. $112. Looks like, what's that, 22 pounds? Not bad at all. I'll take it. I think we did pretty good. Most of this is going to be in our auction tomorrow night, Tuesday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And then we're doing two more auctions this week as well. One on Thursday with yesterday's fits, as we've been doing for the last couple weeks, and a card auction um, on Friday. All right, we're starting out with this Hallmark uh, Valentine's push Day dog. Push its paw. Push its paw. I like big hugs and I cannot lie. There we go. That's just a, <laughs> just a snippet. We don't want to get in trouble with big Hallmark or anything. But yeah, just in time for uh, Valentine's Day last week. So there we yeah. go. <laughs> here we go. This is Nike. Picking up all the Nike dry fit stuff I can for whatever we're paying here. $1.89 a pound. This weighs two, two ounces. So it's like 25 cents or so. This. This is why you go and keep looking around and walking around. At our Goodwill bins, everybody sits up along the side of the wall there, and then when it closes, everybody's throwing stuff back that they don't want. They threw back this car, car Carhartt fire resistant. We figured there would be an issue, and there is. There's some paint on one of the sleeves, but this but is Carhartt. But they don't care if a welder wants this. Exactly. If and they welder, can get it for half the price. I don't even know where it is, but we saw it. Um, yeah, if a welder can get this on sale, they don't really care about the paint. And when it comes to like the pants, especially the older Carhartt pants, they if like they're it all painted stains. up, people like that look. It's it's something that's in style. This is going to go in our auction. Or maybe I'll keep it. This might be my new look. This might be my new thing. <laughs> look at that. Popeye the Sailor Man, full art. The shirt, or are over. you trying to get that buff? Which look is well, it? I mean, like, I always get mistaken for like a fully headed hair of a Popeye the Sailor Man. What is that? A full head of hair version? I can't say it correctly, but you get what I'm trying to say. I look like Popeye is what I'm trying to say. The oh, Tootsie yeah. Pop Owl. Look at that. Oh, how many licks? Uh, I think Does it it's take like to get to the couple thousand? I then think. it hurts your teeth because that exactly. Tootsie Rolls hard. Did you find more of this, by the way? I didn't. I looked. What is this? 1995. 1995's sheets. Top to sheet. The animated Batman. I pick up this brand whenever I'm at the bins. I don't usually pick it up at like Sabres for five or six bucks. What is it? But this is Jamaican Jacks. It's 100% oh. silk. Lounge wear, kind of something you would wear going on a vacation, you know, on a cruise or something. That's like 10 or 15 bucks, no problem. Black Sabbath, pull over, pick that up That's all day. That's auction. That's gonna go in our auction. This is a good brand to look out for, guys. This is Pal and Peralta, which is a skateboarding brand. A lot they of did the, the skateboards for Tony Hawk, right? Exactly. We found a Tony Hawk a vintage skateboard back in the day, and I believe it was Powell and Peralta from the early 80s. So they've done skateboard stuff since the early 80s. This is a bone shirt. I could only find the white version of this, and it got $24 used, $25 used. So I'm going to ask $20, $25 on that shirt. Not bad at all. This just looked cool. This is a famous hotel in Salem, Salem Massachusetts. Massachusetts, a Halloween night. So we bought this. We figured we can get 10 or so. We might put that in the auction. Care Bear. Um, I love me some Care Bears. That was my nickname forever growing up being named Care. This is new in the box. You know what's shocking is they were only asking Yeah, that's surprising. We that would have paid crazy. three bucks. We really, and we would have paid three bucks for that. I would have expected seven ninety nine, ten ninety nine exactly. for that. Exactly. So they priced that right and still even pricing it right, they didn't, they didn't sell, sell it. it. That's how it is sometimes. This is the petting zoo. This but is it's a, a puppet. Oh, it's a puppet. It's an elephant. Hello. I'm an elephant. I never forget. He wants crumpets and tea. Tea and crumpets. Oh, another puppet, actually. It is. It's a snake. Let it be known. Yes, it is a snake. Thank you. And let it be known. <laughs> let it be known that I found this. I found this. Terry We're all found shocked. Me. Saved me from. The Congratulations! Oh, that's, that's my In and Out hat. Now look at your hair. Of how far I've come. I used to work at In and Out. It's a squishmallow, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bird. It's a duck. It's uh, ducks are birds, aren't they? I don't know. Are they? Technically, yeah. Ducks are birds and birds are ducks and little <laughs> little lambs eat ivy or something, right? This, this is, is cute. Vintage 90s. This is electronic. We need to test it out. We have great luck testing stuff About out. About 95%. 95% of the stuff we find at the bins works. works. 
So uh, that's amazing. I wouldn't have thought it would have been that high. This, this is cool. Huge. This is vintage. I looked this up. It's 1971. His glasses are messed up, but it's a vintage. Uh, it's a for a bank or something. Yeah, Hubert the Hubert Hubert the Harris. Somebody like had this at like a antique shop or something. So that's cool. Oh, this is cute. It's we, for F A Schwartz. F A O Schwartz. Yep. F A O Schwartz. Look for Classic that. Classic brand. They're, they they do a lot of plush plushes. Are toys. feel very cool. New Whatever. with the, tech. <laughs> the plushes are filled very full <laughs> with plush. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I get very tongue tied no, when I'm up the here material. too. No, I, the material makes a big difference. Yeah, no, it's true. It's like some of them, the older stuff is stiffer. Um, the real old stuff is like wood chips and paint chips or whatever they put the in there. The well-made ones have a thicker material, mm -hmm. like carpet. These are the, like these newer ones that are mass produced right now. They're thin. Yeah, there's really not like much in it, if that makes sense. There's not like a really firm fit, filling in there at all. Snoopy. Snoopy. Happy Easter, Just in Snoopy. time for Easter. Just in time for Easter, guys. This is cool. Dawn was so excited. She might have been most excited when she saw this because I picked this up and this is a Jurassic Remember, Park. we found that one in Savers and you put it back. And then I went to that section later on and found yeah. it. And you're like, I, I put that back down. We put it in our auction and it sold for like $19. This is a popcorn bucket Jurassic World Fallen King Kingdom. So you would get this at like the movie theater, like an AMC or a cinema. How cool would that have been to eat the popcorn out of that? Uh, probably about as cool as your guys are imagining. Imagine that, guys. <laughs> Let's go back in time. If you were eating popcorn out of that, it would have been heaven. It would have been heaven. Aw. Look at these little I guys. I just thought that was adorable. It is adorable. Look at those cutesies. I love you. Aw. It's bad boss voodoo doll. I, I got this. <laughs> I thought it was cool. That is pretty funny. I've had um, some bad bosses. <laughs> me too. Me too. Stick. What is this? I just thought it was cute. I don't even know what it is. Oh, is it, is it like a piece of toast? Oh, I think we're supposed to. Oh, we're missing the other piece of toast. Oh, we're just, we're, we're only, yeah, we're one toast short. We're, we're toastless. Madon's favorite brands to look out for. Jemmy, G-E-M-M-Y. This is a little space mouse. Love Machine is his name, <laughs> or her name. That's awesome. <laughs> That's a really funny one. Um, next up, we got a Rolling Stone shirt. This is just filler stuff for the auction. Sometimes these get us a couple bucks. Sometimes they do really well. They cost us like 20 cents. Cost us 20 cents, so they're good filler. If nothing else, somebody can get a good uh, deal on a shirt for themselves. Um, this is Five Nights at Freddy. Friday Nights at Freddy's Freddy. with the tag. <laughs> What's his real name? Freddy Faze Bears Pizza Security. Yeah, that's like where where like all the shenanigans take place in that uh, video game, I believe. Oh, this is the goat from uh, Despicable Me. Despicable Me. There's a goat in Despicable Me for some reason. I haven't really seen Despicable Me much. I think I saw the first one. But that's been a long time ago. This is, uh, what is it, Dill City Beer Company. That's cool. It's kind of I a little said snap oil. No, or is oh, it Dill? Is it oil? I don't know what I it is. I think it is oil. Why did I say dill? There's two <laughs> L's. I don't know. We just have different thoughts. I was thinking of pickles because I'm hungry probably. Ooh, this guy's cute. Look at that. It's got the Disney Park tag. Which one is this though? It isn't the one from Nemo. I don't know. What's the other tag on it say? Um, the other tag is just a Disney. manufactured. This is cute. I don't know what that's from. I just grabbed this it. This is, yeah. This is cute though. A little uh, cat bat, with cat, wings. Bat, bat, cat. cat, cat, bat. Here we go. Mo Moana with the little turtle. And sand on her feet. Pre-made sand on her oh, feet. Oh, is that pre-made sand? That's funny. And then we've got a, a troll. troll. Gotta love trolls. Sometimes they're in the comments and we appreciate you all for watching. Thanks guys. No, we actually don't get a lot of trolls. We appreciate that. That's, <laughs> Jurassic World. I've never seen that one, but that the one's cute one. too. Lamp and these shop. are the ones you told me to always pick up. These are great guys. Look out for these. Thank you for mentioning that. These are 1990s loving family little playhouse figures. These typically go for like four or five each. Usually you'll find them in little bags at like a Savers or Goodwill or something in like four or five, you know, figures per bag. You get like four or five of these, that's 20 bucks all day, right, Don? Oh. Sometimes even more. That might now even be a, a little low. we had like a whole box full of them. We were selling them in lots and we were making some so money. So look out for the Loving family. They're, I think they're Mattel. No, they're Play School. They do really well. They're from the 90s. They do great. My favorite team growing up can't really be anymore because I'm in Las Vegas and the Raiders was the San Diego Chargers. They let me down so many years. I'm a Raiders fan now, or, I'm, or at least I'm trying to be. I still kind of like the Chargers, which is not normal for being a Raiders fan. I'm just picking up all Golden Knight stuff. They're having a really good season when it's like going to cost me 25, 30, 40 cents. I'm going to pick that up. It's going to be like 8 to $10 on eBay. 
Um, this right here is a shirt. I can tell Nike Air. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna pick up <laughs> Nike shirts here that are in good condition all day. Not big money, probably like six, seven, eight, nine dollars. This is cool, guys. This is really cool. This is vintage 1990. Look out for this brand right here. Logo, logo 7. seven. Yeah. I love logo seven, Orlando Magic. Um, it says logo seven on the inside. This is what the tag looks like on shirts and pants and stuff. This is like half like basketball short style and half like sweatpants style. Oh, uh -huh. So it's pretty cool. This is 1990s. Should be about a $20 bill-ish on eBay. No problem. Monster Jam. We get a lot of people who ask about Monster Jam stuff. So we pick it up when we can. Rick and Morty stuff. And I stuff. found that Rick and Morty uh, plushie too in here. Oh, you did? Rick yeah. and Morty sells really well in our auction. One Direction does kind of too, actually. I wonder if Run One Direction stuff is making a comeback, or it's not quite old enough yet. I don't know who that is. It's a band, Harry Styles. Oh yeah, I've been seeing a lot of stuff on TikTok about him. Yeah, the Vegas Golden Knights, another long sleeve shirt. Um, and then I just like the artwork on this. I'm not sure what how well it? this will do. It's just like a like some sort of bar and grill, but it has oh, a motorcycle cool. on it um, with a front pocket. Cool artwork. You could take chances at the bin when you're not bins, when you're not paying that much money, right? So that's what we do. We take chances, try different stuff. This was cool. This was the Bazaar Tourism Department. Just kind of a cool, looks like a Titanic and stuff. Oh, that's neat. Just kind of cool artwork. Cool artwork stuff can do really, oh, yeah. really well in the auction. Carrie had to have this. I had to have this. If this, you know, if we're going to try to clean it up because it's pretty dirty. If this doesn't get cleaned up, it's going to go up on my shelf. This is the Hawks MBA, but it's not the Atlanta Hawks. It's the St. Louis Hawks. And this is um, something that Reeboks did in the early 2000s, like, you know, 2002, 2003, 2004, called the Funk. So these are like all the teams that are no longer in those cities. So this is was new, but obviously was worn, um, has a lot of sweat wear. But if we can clean this, it'll go in the auction. Um, might go on eBay if we can clean it, or I don't know. I'm cool keeping it. That's a no brainer. Here we go, Buzz Lightyear. Laser gun, we'll take that working all day. This is a PJ mask, some sort of exo suit. First thingy in the middle. It's like some sort of robot thing. I just saw that movie. Remember that movie, um, Day, Edge of Tomorrow? Oh yeah. That's such a good movie. Guys, go watch that. That reminded me of, ooh, a Charles Barkley basketball card. This isn't worth that much money, but I like it. I threw it in there. See how distracted I got? Um, next up we have, what is this, tie-dye? Oh, what is this, MGM Grand? I don't know. I don't know. It just looks cool. We like tie-dye I just like tie-dye does well in our auction. Exactly. And we're losing weight, so we might fit into that soon. How much have you lost so far, Don? Uh, almost winning. 20 pounds. He's almost at 20. I'm at 17 and a half pounds, so we're getting there. I've still got a ways to go. Guns N' Roses shirt. Favorite Guns N' Roses song, Don? Ooh, uh, uh, Paradise City probably is the most famous one i would say I, I, I like i like civil war and i like november uh, rain november rain is my favorite but civil war is growing on me a lot do you know what this um logo is for don it's under longhorn armor. steakhouse it, it that's a good guess that's a really good guess but it's the rock <laughs> under armor did stuff with the rock so the, this rock is the rock has a bull as his thing yeah that's just like his logo oh i don't know if it's from his wrestling days or what so this is cool we get a lot of raiders stuff not all of it is las vegas raiders I just noticed it has a hole. <laughs> That's why you have Harry, to do a better never job. never look at this. They just wasted this? 25 cents. I'll have to lose some weight. Way to go. No! <laughs> why did I do that? Here's a Harley Quinn, Birds of Prey, so the movie they did a couple that years bird ago. Just... Yeah, there was a bird that, right when I said that. Birds of Prey? Ha <laughs> San Francisco 49ers, mid-2000s Reeboks. Reeboks had the NFL license, I believe, from like the late 90s to the mid, like 06, 07, 08, I believe. So usually when you find Reeboks NFL stuff, it's the 2000s, um, not 2010s, but the 2000s. This guy, he is Rumble from Rumble. I don't know what that is. Looks like a cartoon. He looks cute. He looks pretty cute. How'd you think, Don? Mm -hmm. Next up we have, this is a Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon. This will be, a lot of these will be in an auction. A lot of them will be lotted up in the auction. Raggedy Ann. We pick up all the Raggedy Ann and Andy stuff that we can find. Wonder Woman. Going to pick that up all day. Here's some toys Don found. Finn. I forgot her name, but she's from Star Wars. Hawkman. Not Hawkeye, but Hawkman from DC. We got a black suit Spider-Man. Let's see what else we got. Ooh, this is new with the tag. Oh, here's that unicorn uh, from Despicable Me. Brand new with the tag. A lot of these smaller clutches typically get lotted up together in the auction, right, Don? Yeah. This is BTS. Is that a band? Yeah, Don was asking me, is BTS a, a band? And I'm like, um, yeah, BTS is a big deal. 
yeah, very big deal. I have to kind of check that out to see if it's authentic or not, but still cool. Always pick up stuff like that. There's no real harm. At That's the, the Rick and Morty plush. Oh, this is Rick and Morty? I don't know what character this is because I don't watch it's many of the episodes. It's a unicorn horse baby or something. Unicorn, yes. Unicorn horse baby. And this That's is a, a very upset, distraught This kitty. is a distraught, sad, some would say grumpy cat. Um, this is a cool tie-dye already. I like the yellow. I just got the because it was tie-dye. Dope Forever 21. We'll pick it up. Tie-dye stuff does well for us seems to be I don't know we're probably behind what the trends are but it seems to be in style um what is this Eeyore oh that's cool and this is the style is like 2000s this is not quite vintage but also not new so we'll take that this is an all over print sponge I found a few spongebobs this is he doesn't know spongebob this I just cool. threw it in the cart this stuff does really well in our auction this Cogsworth uh, from Beauty and the Beast tale as old as time song is old as well barely even friends i don't know what this, this is, is a transformer I... this is a metal one too see this is interesting i don't know if this this is a reproduction one uh what the sorry guys we're learning on the fly it says 1983 i think this is a generation one star wars figured on honestly we're gonna do we're gonna put a a comp up here we have to do some research on this but i think this is g1 because it says 1980 80 and 1983 takara um and it's metal which is a good sign this is plastic but this parts of it are metal at least so it's either a remake, which is going to be good, or it's an original. So we know that this is good, though, guys. This, I'm knocking stuff over. Sorry, Don. You want to tell them about this? This is wool. So it's upside wool down. Wool blankets so. can fetch a lot of money. Merino so wool. We're paid Marquis. maybe $3 for this at that. And this thing can go anywhere from 100 to $300, depending on size. I had to just measure it. But it does have one little stain on it, but I still think it'll sell. This will. I think so, yeah. Merino will. It's 100% wool. You put that in the back, yeah. Put that in the back. Next up, let me get the thing that fell on the floor. It's Spider Man. He is okay. Safe and sound, Spider Man. Next up, we have ooh, this guy. See, some of these guys I don't even know we got. He's vintage. Oh, look, he's like a cute little dog guy. He is a, a engineer. Oh, he's a oh he's a railroad engineer. Yes, he's wearing his bibs and his he's hat. Got his bibs and everything. That's awesome. These all light up. Press the ponies. press the thing. Pre press the thing on this one. Oh, this one. And they're is all working. No, this one works. How do you, where do you do it? You push the diamond. Oh, does it light up there? I can't see it. Yeah, it was lighting up in there when I got it. Oh, yeah, it's lighting up. Okay, and this one too. On to the next one. We've got these Steelers. Steelers always do well. We don't have any problem selling that stuff. Off the wall. I like band stuff. I'll either sell that or keep it, honestly. This is cute. This is Carter's. Not the best brand in the world, but this is just cute. Ragamuffin Teddy little backpack, little cute kid's backpack. I believe this is Toy Box, which is a Disney store branded uh, toy. Not the ones like you would get at a, you know, um, to uh, Walmart or Target. This would actually be at the Disney store. They're not super, super valuable. That's probably like a $5 figure. This is from Hello Neighbor, Funko Pop. We'll pick up those in the bins. At bins prices, we'll pick up loose Funko Pops because we can lot them up. This is Adventure Planet. I just like a gopher or something. Like I a gopher or a wombat or- This is vintage. Vintage unicorn. Donut. I a don't... donut. Oh, little cat donut. Cat I didn't... donut. There we go. There's awesome. a few. We got, oh, we got another one. That one doesn't make noise. The next one does. Look at this. That I... has to be cleaned. This has to be cleaned, but this is Statue of Liber Liberty Mini Plus. That's dope. Yeah. And it's Disney Store. This is a tag you want to look for. It doesn't mean it's going to sell fast. But when you do stuff like us through the auctions on whatnot, this stuff will make you a profit if you're getting it at bins prices. The key is what you pay. You make the money in the buy. If you pay low enough, you're always going to come out ahead. And people are going to get deals too, so it's a win-win for everybody. This is cool. This is actually a single stitch Carnival Cruise Line. Single stitch on the sleeve. If you want to make sure it's even, like, even older, from what I understand, it's single stitch down here as well. Carnival Cruise Line. It's got those 80 or 90s, you know, teals and purples and pinks that were everywhere, like the Dixie Cup vibe. Oh yeah. Um, so that that'll sell probably. Ooh, this is cool. Whoa. Oh, does he have a terror? Does he? I didn't notice that. Look at that little stuff. I still stuff like that, it. I still think we'll get a. That few bucks was the for first it. time we. No, we ain't selling that. I'm throwing that away. We're gonna throw it away. Okay. We're gonna throw it away. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> Okay, we had to quit putting stuff in the cart, not going through it. There's I told them unicorn. I didn't buy that either. Well, I didn't buy it. Maybe somebody's just putting stuff in our carts, Dom. That's what <laughs> I'm going to say. This is a Dalmatian. This is Disney Store, I believe. Yep, 
Disney Parks. <laughs> Disney Parks. Um, oh, look at this guy. He's cute. He's a wolf. Do you remember the Do you remember the movie Iron Will? Yes. I love that movie. This reminds me of, like Call the Wild. Uh, he's Iron Will. he's howling, but his eyes are closed. How cute! I know this cute. This is cute. This is a uh, giraffe backpack. Pretty cute. Plush. This is a cat with glasses. Plush. Let's go <laughs> on to the next one. This is Mickey. We need to clean it up. What the heck? <laughs> That's free. You gotta keep the house. Like, what the heck? He's cute though. Look at that Mickey. Oh, we need to go through our cart before we pay, <laughs> Carrie. Look at all. This. We, we, we spent dollars of money that we probably shouldn't have. Oh, this is cool. The, do you know the name of this vehicle, Don? The Enterprise. The, S, the Enterprise. Exactly, guys. The Titanic. The Titanic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. This is cute. Vintage with the tag. For Perfection. Is that what it's called? That's cute. Little cat. I'm more of a dog guy. So, he threw this in the cart. We don't know where This it is came Nike. From. Yeah, I threw this in the cart, but it's good. It's Nike Golf, women's Nike Golf. Okay. I knew what it was because I'm great at what I do, guys. I know what I'm doing. Well, obviously, this is vintage. This is vintage. Oh, that's Care Bear. Cute. Oh, is this Care Bear? Yep. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is uh, adorable. Quilt, Can baby we keep quilt. This? Can we keep? For you? Please? Please? God, he's such a baby. Please? No. For me? I know we have no, to sell. No, yeah. Goon. Oh man. <laughs> this is the Colorado. But this guy's Bell. adorable, guys. He's like a little Look. saxophone player. Colorado Bell Tag. Love it. Yes. Next up we've got the Kodak Film Bear. This is cute. With the Texas smile. Next up we ooh, this is cool. SpongeBob. Another all over print SpongeBob square pants shirt. Then we've got See this is why I need to go through some. Oh, he's got this. a comb. He's got to brush that mop. Look at him. That actually kind of it's works. It's adorable, though. Look. It is kind of cool. Let me see the tag. Because I... Kelly Toy. I think he's vintage. Kelly Toy. This is vintage. Yeah, this is definitely 90s. He's or maybe adorable. Even 80s. Adorable monkey with his comb. Well, crochet It's, it's crocheted snake. snake, so I got it. It's not. It's nice. homemade. I was, I was watching TikTok, and then somebody was uh, doing a TikTok about a... Or maybe it was an Instagram story about a snake that was in their toilet. Oh, so now what? I'm scared of that. Just FYI. Gotta push the thing. Oh, here we go. This one also likes to get his hair combed. That's awesome. Oh, this guy I just thought was cute. He's got his little outfit on. Oh, his look, he's security. got his little outfit. He just works security. He's security dog. He's not even, a, yeah, he's just a security dog. So we're gonna go ahead and move to the next one. Oh, this is, I keep forgetting what the pig is. Pua? Oh, it's got a hole. Dang it, see, we got it. I told you. We I need to start you. going through our cart before we pay. I told you, Don. It's okay, it happens. We're still doing well. That's the thing. Honestly, you can make some mistakes like that when you're at the bins and stuff is so cheap. It's kind of negligible. Um, we've gotten better though, haven't we? We've oh, gotten yeah. better about that. This is cool. All over print with the nice, nice, vibrant, colorful print on the front. We've had a lot of cool SpongeBob shirts. Those are definitely going to be in the auction. I don't know why I grabbed this. I thought it was... <laughs> I'm, trying, I'm really trying to figure out what it is. Is it a wrap? Just to remind you guys one more time, we have our Whatnot Goodwill Bins auction tomorrow, Tuesday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. It's going to be a lot of fun. We'd love to see you guys there. We also have our auction with Jesse at Yesterday's Fits at his store on Thursday. A lot of vintage clothes and other vintage items in that one. We're also going to do another card show on a Friday from 2.30 on. We're breaking a couple different products and doing some single cards. So a lot of Whatnot stuff going on. If you're new to Whatnot and haven't used it and you want $15 in free credit, you can use the link down below. It'll give you $15 to spend with me or whoever you want. It's up to you guys. Do whatever you like. Also, one more thing. I just gotta, I gotta plug this because it's cool. The 5% off for Supply Hut. If you want to save some money on your supplies, it's, it's a pretty good link, guys. There's only a few of us that have it. Um, it's going to be down below. There's the uh, link and then also the code that you can use to save money on your supplies. Thank you, guys. I appreciate the support. We appreciate the support. And we'll catch you next time.